Oh, the Lord is good to me, and so I thank the Lord for giving me the things I need, the sun and the rain and the apple seed. The Lord is good to me. Amen, 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 amen. Amen. So if you worked at camp, you either, there was, there's like, two main versions to do that, right? Either you, you hold the ah as long as you can and, it, and everybody giggles and has a good time, or I think you do amen, 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 huh, because uh, huh is the, the, the way to end a lot of these songs. So you may, many of you, I sure know Johnny Appleseed. It's funny because growing up in Pennsylvania, we used to be careful when we sang it because uh, oftentimes, um, I don't know if it's tradition or, or, or mythology, you know, it, it brings, it's supposed to bring rain, right? It, it comes from, I believe, the, uh, uh, the fruit of the, the ground uh, and, and, and uh, harvest and things. And so I, I, growing up outside of Pennsylvania um, or outside of Gettysburg, Pennsylvania there, we would sing that. But some years it was just storm after storm, rain after rain. And so we'd have to be careful with uh, how, how, we, how often we sang it. Now I'm realizing in New Mexico, we need to sing it all the time. Because boy, oh day, do we need some rain. Friends, uh, welcome to this time of devotion, dwelling in God's Word uh, on the feast day of St. Michael and all angels. So there's one for you. Look that up. We're going to spend a little time dwelling in God's Word. If you have your Bible there, we're going to spend some time in Psalm 103. Is that right, correct? Uh, a couple verses here, well, 1 through 5, and then 20. 20 through 22. All right, very good. So let's spend some time. We'll read together here in devotion. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is, is, is within me. Bless God's holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and do not forget all his benefits. Boy, there's a good song right there. Who forgives all your iniquity, who heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from the pit, who crowns you with steadfast love and mercy, who satisfies you with good with good as long as you live, so that your youth is renewed like, like the eagles. And then over to verse 20. Bless the Lord, O you his angels, you mighty ones who do his bidding, obedient to his spoken word. Bless the Lord, all his hosts, his ministers that do his will. Bless the Lord, all his works in all places of his dominion. Bless the Lord, Oh, my soul. I love those, um, those turns of phrases like, bless the Lord, that sound uh, like a song uh, coming off even the spoken word. So um, Nancy Morrison, who's often on here dwelling in God's word through Christ in our homes, uh, got to work a little bit early today. And so she's going to uh, read our devotion for us here on this day of St. Michael and all angels. Good morning. Today's devotion is entitled, Michael and All Angels. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Verse 1. Our grandkids have learned the Johnny Appleseed prayer. Oh, the Lord is good Whenever to me. Whenever our family's together for a meal, one of us always requests it. We hold hands and sing with gusto, Oh, the Lord is good to me, <laughs> and so I thank the Lord. This simple song calls us to gratitude and grounds us in grace. The psalmist provides a litany of profound reasons for us to bless the Lord. God forgives, heals, redeems, crowns, satisfies, renews. To consider for even a moment what God has done for us is to be driven to our knees in gratitude and praise. But the angels, the mighty ones who do God's bidding, are simply told to bless the Lord without a similar rationale. Perhaps to do God's bidding, to live in obedience to God's will, is all the rationale one needs. Today is a lesser church festival called Michael and All Angels. As we remember these mighty servants of God, we join with them to bless the Lord. Join me in the prayer today. Lord of all, how vast is your mercy, how great your love. Inspire me to bless your holy name. Amen. And our prayer concern throughout the day is for congregations to have a sense of gratitude. Amen. Thanks be to God. I give thanks for your presence today here in devotion, dear friends. All right, everybody, here we go. Oh, the Lord is good to me, and so I thank the Lord for giving me the things I need, the sun and the rain and the apple seed. The Lord is good to me. Amen. 
Amen, amen, amen. Amen.